Mark, thank you very much for your time. It was a, a frustrating afternoon here. We, we came out in the second half after a, a poor first half from both teams and, and looked to take the advantage. Yeah, listen, we, we scored a great goal to go 1-0 up against a good side. And then Florian Canberra has another massive chance that he needs to take, that he has to score. And then the game just swung in their direction and it's unacceptable. The goals were absolutely embarrassing. It's, it's a shame, isn't it? Because it, it felt like such a positive in the, the start of the second time. And like you said, the, the game seemed to swing on that, that one chance that, that Flo unfortunately couldn't take. Yeah, listen, the game definitely swung on that. And that's what I keep saying. We need serious players who are going to drive each other to win games and it comes down to concentration. And if you let them off the hook at 1-0 like that and I just felt that we lost our shape, probably due to a lot of new faces coming in the team and for me the goals were absolutely unacceptable and I've made that clear there. I'll be picking my team now moving forward and uh, I've had a lot of answers there from what I've seen there in the second half and I'm very unsatisfied with it. It was, like you say, a lot of new faces. I think the average age of the team that started was just under 24, and that's the, the youngest of the season. And I think if we, we take a step back, that's probably a, a lot of good experience for some younger players who are making their first starts for the club. Yeah, listen, I think he's all known me by now. I couldn't care less what the average age was and if that was positive or no. I want to win games. I'm proud to be involved at this club and to lead this club in the FA Cup. And I wanted to, I wanted to go through into the next round today. And these three goals were uh, embarrassing for me. And we have to take a good look at ourselves moving forward now because in the last two games, the goals we've conceded have not been us. And uh, there'll be some important decisions made leading up the hill now. And we need to get men in the team. Like you say, it's, it's an important few games now in the league, especially it's a, a possibly a make or break time of the season with the, the fixtures coming up. With the past couple of results, this will give us a, a real need to, to you know have a look at ourselves and get ready for these next few fixtures. Listen, it's the story of the season. You know, you're four points from the whole start of the season and then you go to start win games and draw games and have good performances and then everybody just relaxes. That's not what it's about. We've got to drive each other. We've got to be more focused, more concentrated and show more discipline. And I felt like we were very undisciplined there in the second half, especially with our shape. And we didn't defend the crosses well enough there in the box. We didn't manage the situations well. Um, Kasumu could have cleared it before the cross came in as well there for the goal. And as I said, it's about being honest with each other and speaking to each other openly and honestly, because if you bluff each other, you're not going to move forward. And for me, that was an unacceptable second half. Mark, thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much. Cheers, Head it up.